well another lovely morning and um, we're still in Ross's Point. Uh, we only plan to spend one night but the Shanty <laughs> Festival um, took hold of us. Took hold. The Sea Shanty Festival. It was just amazing. Everyone's lovely. We've done so much singing. That's why we're a little bit hoarse this morning. <laughs> um, and they've got a ceremony um, up by the statue, uh, which is where we were parked right next to the RNLI yeah. spot. So we moved. <laughs> yeah, out of respect because obviously there's loads of different countries. Um, it's an international um, ceremony and it's going to be a remembrance ceremony. So just out of respect, we've just moved out of the way a little bit. Spot just up the road. So today we're going to continue our journey south um, through Sligo, probably getting a bit of shopping. The shops here in Ireland on Sundays are open one till Sorry. six. I thought I dribbled, so I just went like that. But then I realised I hadn't. I knew she didn't dribble, but <laughs> we can carry on. I mean, if she wants to dribble, that's fine. <laughs> so before I was so rudely interrupted. <laughs> We're going to go into Sligo, probably get a bit of shopping. Sligo. Sligo. And then we're going to head down to Strand Hill. Um, everybody said that Strand Hill um, is a really nice place to go. So we'll show you in a bit. So we're going to get Trudy packed up, um, just do the washing up and stuff, and then we'll be on the road. Up, up, up in a painted cup, I will pour my love from a cloud above. So bright I can see the lights Taking you up and above the blue sky Tastes good to be drinking all of the honey sweet brew of ours Up, up in a painted cup Right in the sky like a firefly Like a firefly I believe to believe is to feel So this morning we've woken up in Strand Hill, um, continuing on a journey south along the Atlantic Way. And wow, the sun is trying to come out and the noise of the waves here is amazing. I know why they call this part um, the surf part of Ireland on the Wild Atlantic Way because the waves are huge um, or bigger than normal that we're used to. Um, so check out this view from the bed what a view to wake up to this morning. things we've noticed in the van is that we don't really eat that much like we used to because we're not sticking to the regular breakfast at that time lunch at that time and dinner at that time um, so yesterday we didn't really eat that much did we so we've woken up starving so I'm going to attempt to do our first cooked breakfast in the van because normally we just have a bit of bread um, some cereal um, so yeah so we've managed to get some beef sausages because Marianne doesn't eat pork and um, some bacon and we've got potato cakes um, everybody in Ireland said to me when you're in Ireland you have to eat potato cakes they have them traditionally with the fried breakfast so we're gonna uh, cook them for the first time 
and um, yeah we're gonna give the ridge monkey another go see how that does for the cooked breakfast I've got a cheeky little bit of bacon just to add a bit of uh, loveliness and make the van smell nice so here goes so I've got the sausages in the ridge monkey um, I'm going to cook it from cold so that the heat actually goes all the way through the sausage because I think if you heat up the ridge monkey first you'll probably be a bit like a barbecue where you heat up the outside but doesn't the heat doesn't get all the way through um, so we'll give that a go mmm potato cakes so we're trying to cook everything in the ridge monkey just to save washing up. So we're going to do the sausage, the bacon, then the potato cakes, fried eggs, scrambled eggs, and uh, we'll see if it all works in the in the ridge monkey. One thing we have noticed is the ridge monkey it does drip a little bit uh, from the condensation. So just be aware that if you're cooking in it a lot, it just the condensation drips out of the corners, which isn't a problem because we can just wipe it up. But just be aware depending on what you're cooking on. Mmm, looking good. It worked really well. Breakfast time. So we're going to just try the potato bread. I think it's called bread. It says on the packet potato files. Potato files. So it's potato bread or potato cake or whatever it's called. Files. Um, and it looks yummy. I suppose it's the Irish equivalent of a hash brown. Let's see what it tastes like. Mm. It's um, it's doughier. It's doughier than bread. So it's not, it's, I think my brain's trying to tell me it's bread, but and it's not thin slices of potato. I don't know how they've made it, but yeah, it's nice. I think it's potato and flour mixed, isn't it? Mm. Let's give this potato a try. It's not what you think it's going to be. Yeah, it's not bread and it's not potato. It's kind of halfway in between. Mm. But it's nice flavour though. Yeah, it's nice. Goes really well with the cooked breakfast. So we're leaving Strand Hill and we're heading back into Sligo. Um, we're going to the three shop because we our data has pretty well run out and we're starting to incur charges. So we need to go and get another um, get a page you go After sim. 100 yards, turn left. Oh, that'll be the sack now. And we're also, to, this afternoon about four o'clock, we're gonna meet up with a lady by the name of Mary, who very kindly contacted us on Facebook. And it was Mary um, who suggested that we go to the Shanty Festival. So thank you, Mary. We had an absolute fab time. We love Shanty. Yay! <laughs> And we're looking forward to seeing you this afternoon. In fact, we're going to go to Holland near Groningen because we've been invited by a group of shanty singers from Holland. Woohoo! We love shanty After singing! It was fun. It really was, was fun. Really good fun. First exit. So we're just leaving Sligo Town and we sorted out our three mobile. So the yeah, we got a really good deal. It was 20 euros a month um, for unlimited data that we can use. So we can watch YouTube videos, we can update YouTube videos. It's all good. 
and we are just driving to try and find the lovely Mary's house who has been um, sending us loads of advice online on what to see and what to do. So we're popping to go say hi to her. Is it? <laughs> Have we got the right house? Huh? 